In 2024, Mastering SEO doesn't have to drain your wallet. Whether you are a small business, a blogger or a startup, free tools are more powerful than ever, helping you compete with big brands without spending on premium SEO tools. There are so many things involved in SEO, keyword research, on-page SEO, off-page SEO, link building, content writing and many more stuff. And it's quite obvious that if you want all of these features, it's going to be expensive for premium tools like Ahrefs or SEMrush. The key is knowing which tools to use how to leverage them for maximum impact all right in this video i'm going to discuss with you guys 20 of the best free seo tools that can skyrocket your websites on top of google's rankings without compromising on quality or results for completely free hello guys welcome to digital anki youtube channel i'm nandakishore if you are new around here subscribe to digital anki youtube channel for more valuable tips on digital marketing so Let's get started. Step 1 doing keyword research. If you want to rank your website on top of search results, then you should be doing keyword research. And it is the foundation of any successful SEO strategy. It helps you discover what your target audience is searching for and allows you to create content that matches their search intent. Now, I'm going to show you how you can do that with the help of free SEO tools. The first tool that I have for you is Glimpse. It is a Google Trends powered Chrome extension. You can use this for free, but the limitation is you will get a free searches per month it provides keyword search volume and trend data you can instantly get insights into potential keyword opportunities while browsing making it an easy and fast tool for finding profitable keywords without leaving your browser you can explore its recommended top trending topics by category the next tool we have is exploring topics in the free plan you can check the keyword trends for 2 years and above you can choose the niche and see what's getting more growth as you can see here chat gpt for youtube it's getting more search volume going ahead and it's good for you to consider the keywords that are new and trending topics to write blogs you can also try the uber suggest free plan and get 150 daily searches if you opt for its 7 day free trial and later you can cancel it if you want so it shows a lot of information like search volume based on the countries additional keyword ideas around that topic and more content ideas from competitors what i would suggest is that you should go with niche specific keywords and check with these tools what's trending and get more insights as to what you want to write blogs about so after you have found and decided on the keyword and the topic for the blog the next thing is content writing step 2 content writing all right you have found some great keyword ideas it's time for us to create content for that let's see how do we write content now well you can use surfer SEO's free AI blog content outline generator. For instance, I want to write an article about email marketing. Just enter that and hit generate outline. As you can see, Surfer SEO will start writing an outline for you. It's very essential to have an outline with a clear structure, right? All right, we have some outlines that we can't use in our blog post straight away. You can sort of get some ideas uh, from these outlines and give a human touch, adding your own experience like what you know about the topic. Doing so will give a natural touch to your article and can get better results in the search engine. You know, Google likes fresh and original content rather than AI written content. I have seen lots of video claiming that you can create 100 blogs in just 2 minutes using ChatGPT. Yes, you can, but if you're not adding human text in your article, then my friend that's not going to work so basically you create an outline using the surfer seo outline generator make sure to check the grammar using tools like grammarly and add human experience before you hit publish all right you have done the keyword research written the content and published now it's time to track the results or i would say rankings step 3 track the rankings so for this the most commonly used tools from google are search console and Google Analytics. You can easily integrate them to your WordPress website using Google SiteKit plugin. It will start showing you the results right inside your WordPress dashboard. Apart from these tools, you can also use another popular free tool from Ahrefs, which is the Keyword Rank Checker. For instance, I'm going to take this keyword and the URL and then I'll click Check Rankings and it will show you where this ranks on the SERP. So it says number 4 for best WordPress LMS plugins. DR is 90, 1.5k backlinks, 249 domains pointing to this traffic etc. So you put in the individual keyword in these tools to find what you are actually 
ranking for you know when you're actually using free tools there are lots of limitations you can't actually see a detailed ranking changes and variations for all of your blog posts in one single place i suggest to consider the search console results for impression clicks and the average position you are getting awesome we have talked about the keyword research content writing and tracking the rankings now the essential aspect of seo is link building let's discuss how we can actually do link building for free well it's quite easy but you have to do it effectively to get the best results all right first thing first what exactly is link building and why should you care about it in simple terms link building is the process of getting other websites to link back to your website think of these links as words of confidence from other sites when search engines see reputable sites linking to yours it's a signal that your content is trustworthy and valuable this can help improve your domain rating boost your authority and ultimately help you rank higher on google if you're just starting out link building might sound intimidating big established sites naturally attract links because they already have authority but as a new site you don't have that advantage so you might be wondering if it's even possible to build links things at this stage the good news it absolutely is and it's worth putting in the effort effective link building can help you build that initial domain rating and give your website the credibility boost it needs what you can actually do is create a list of 100 sites with a domain rating over 50 to 70 and then you need to find out whom to reach out to for this i'm going to give a couple of tools that you can use linkedin and hunter.io you can go to linkedin and search for a person who works there so you enter the company and the website and then you find the content manager or seo manager or somebody similar to these roles connect with them and find their name if you have both their company name and their name you can use hunter.io which will give you the format of their email it could be their first dot last name at their company.com it could be just first name or it could be just last name you get the point right but anyway it will tell you specifically based on scanning the web what the format of their professional or work email so you have their name you have their email you seed all of that information to google sheet and then you just send that email so you send targeted guest post outreach emails to these sites for link building with gmail and then you can use a tool like upspot sales which is a free chrome extension that gives you like five email templates you click a button in gmail and it just pops up the entire email and ready to go wait you should personalize it add the first name and then write a personalized initial sentence right and then hit send asking for a guest post link partnership and all of those and remember when it comes to link building these links are value exchange right you should always provide value in exchange for getting backlinks to your site don't just ask for things for nothing in return i recommend you add a few lines like you know i contribute guest post to other i authority sites in your niche and you'd be happy to include link to your site in those articles by this way you are open and friendly your initial a conversation without being more assertive mastering this approach over time can help you build a solid relationship before diving into one of my favorite SEO tools and walking through my exact step-by-step -step process let's first explore a couple of free notable tools that you might find useful these tools can give you a solid foundation and make your SEO journey much smoother more free tools for SEO most offers a variety of free SEO tools that can be incredibly useful from brand authority keyword explorer link explorer competitive research and domain analysis there is a robust set of features available at no cost these tools provide valuable insights to help you strengthen your seo strategy and understand your competition better another powerful tool to have in your seo arsenal is screaming frog Known for its technical SEO capabilities, Screaming Frog crawls your site to identify issues, helping you spot and fix any technical roadblocks. It's a great way to ensure your site is optimized and free of errors that might affect performance. With Screaming Frog's free version, you can analyze up to 500 URLs, allowing you to identify broken links, review metadata, and discover duplicate pages. It's a fantastic way to tackle foundational SEO issues without a big budget, ensuring your site runs smoothly and is optimized for search engine. So it's a great free SEO tool, you know, for technical analysis for your site. Finally, I want to share my favorite free SEO tools that I use the most for my SEO activity, that is Detailed. So Detailed is a free Chrome extension that helps you analyze most of your SEO activity. You can go to detailed.com and check more about this tool and you can click this to add to your chrome or firefox browser as you can see over 
300,000 users getting SEO insights in a click. It's 100% free. Once you've added this to your browser, you can go here and with just one click, you see it's that simple, right? It shows your title, description and URL. And here you can check all your headings, URLs, images and more. The cool thing about this tool is that you can right click to highlight no follow URLs and you can perform domain searches and more. And there you have it, the free SEO tools to skyrocket your website for free. If you're still watching this video, please comment down below. I watched the video till the end and uh, let me know if you have any questions or if you want to see more such useful tools on SEO and digital marketing, please feel free to drop your questions in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, share it with your friends and help them succeed in their SEO career. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to Digital Anke and ring the bell for more valuable content like this. Drop your questions or share your SEO journey in the comment section below. Follow me on Instagram Instagram at digital underscore RNK for more tips on digital marketing. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.